By one account whilst investigating something in space in 2020, Ace met the Doctor again, who was now in their 13th incarnation. Because of the terms they'd parted on years earlier, Ace struggled to trust the Doctor, remembering what she used to be like but nonetheless accepted her help. While waiting for the Doctor's then-companions Yasmin Khan and Ryan Sinclair to be taken, she was abducted by a squad of rats in Yaz's place and brought to Halaji Carey, the former envoy of Fenric who'd organized her being swept away to Iceworld personally. Eventually, the Doctor arrived to rescue her and found that she was acting as the emissary for the Wraiths as she had planned for her all those years ago. When the Wraiths let Ace go, wishing to remain as they were in containment and no longer evoke a war, Ace pursued Halaji Carey to get revenge. She ignored the doctor's pleas for her not to act and decided for herself to allow Halaji Carey to live so he could seek out everybody he had taken and return them home before surrendering himself to the Shadow Proclamation for a final prosecution. After the doctor returned everybody home, she delivered a letter Ace had written to her friend Will Buckland, informing him that she'd stayed behind to settle matters with the Wraiths and left him in charge of a charitable earth until she returned. According to another account, Ace first met the 13th Doctor in 2022, three decades, after her initial travels with him. She had been recruited by Unit along with Tegan Javanka and witnessed the Doctor bring the Spymaster into custody, teasing him that last she'd seen him he was, half-cat. The Doctor left her and Tegan to watch the Master, however he unleashed an army of Cybermen on them. Ace escaped by parachuting off the roof of Unit's HQ however was shot down by a Cyberman and was only saved by Yasmin Khan materializing the TARDIS right beneath her. Yaz sent her to a volcano to stop the Daleks part in the Master's Dalek plan, where AI hologram the Doctor had secretly planted on Ace at unit activated due to her being in deadly danger. The hologram took the form of the Seventh Doctor, giving Ace the chance to apologize to him, before encouraging her into action. As she moved against the Daleks, she encountered Graham O'Brien who was also investigating the Daleks and together they blew up their base. Ace then helped the Doctor pilot the TARDIS before being returned to Earth by Yaz. Ace later joined Graham, Yaz, Tegan Javanka, Melanie Bush, Joe Jones, Kate Stewart and Ian Chesterton at a support group meeting for former companions of the Doctor that Graham had organized. According to one account, while in the A Charitable Earth headquarters, Ace was thinking back on her old adventures until she heard the TARDIS, with the seventh doctor knocking on her door. Excited, she went to him. Ace attended Sarah Jane Smith's memorial on a bright, cold spring day, where she discussed Sarah Jane with other guests, and helped fight the jackals of the backwards clock to foil the trickster's revenge plot. Towards the end of the service, she recalled her memories of Sarah Jane to Luke, Clyde and Ronnie. She left the funeral with K-9 Mark IV, adopting him as her own, 